battlefield of eternity. I had to sank for a single hero because he was taking too much damage from Zuljin. But really, how does Zuljin get 30 stacks by level 10? People just don't know the other heroes. I, you know, every time enemy has Zuljin, I say don't give him free stacks, but it always happens anyway. The spawn is not random, just Google you if you'll find how it works. I know how it works. Some are random, some are predetermined. It's a three tribute cycle. Like if it's top left, mid top, next will be bot right. But if it's top left, then bot right, it can be mid top or bottom top, uh, uh, mid bottom. Greetings, friend. Thanks for the sub, Sherpik. In this case, I'm gonna go Suljin. Um, just to deny it. Because too, uh, too frustrating. Like, Zuljin is the same as Garrosh. People that play into Zuljin, which is like almost everyone, will just make them completely OP. They're not really OP. It's just people constantly play into it. Yeah, I'll play Alarak and answer. Sure. Warrior combat. I bring the mega death. What do you mean by playing into Zuljin? It's like half the player base on my team doesn't understand uh, this. You want axe. This thing here, quest, reward, reward. Like you could have a five support team and out heal 100% of Zuljin's damage and not care about him auto attacking you. You don't lose the lane. You don't lose towers. You don't lose any heroes. And yet, you will make him a late game monster, give him 100 bonus damage on his auto attack. That makes it completely unfeasible to go up against him as if he's like normal worth of a hero. He'll be like super pumped. It's like in other MOBAs where they jungle all game and then they get uh, higher level, higher gold, better items. That's what people are doing. When you are tank, Especially when you are... Because, like, if you're Vala, if you take five hits from Zuljin, you're dead. So, she doesn't really get to misplay against Zuljin. But on every warrior in the Nexus, there is the onus that just because you can trade damage, doesn't mean you should. You should not do that into Zuljin. Where there was two warriors in this game, and it was me and it was Stitches, and I was solo lane the whole game. So when I check... The talents and I see 30 stacks Suljin by like six minutes. I know what happened. Vilnius will rise again. I guess Greyman will be top. Like, if you want to take free damage against Lunara while depleting her mana, that's, like, kind of fine, because she doesn't get a stack from it. But against Chromie, Gul'dan, Zul'jin, trading is so bad, and people don't check talents or don't know the hero. So then it's, like, my duty, uh, I feel like, to tell them. Breath. But 90% of when I tell them, ju they just trade anyway. You really have to avoid that lane. You have a much better mid to late game. And generally, when you lose, 
if anyone does say something about why you lost, they'll be wrong about it, probably. They'll be like, well, we lost because of this one rotation or this boss or whatever. But like, m did you also count the 20,000 extra damage Sil'jin is doing in the late game? You should. Um, I'm going to be solo against Artanas or Mouth. No, no, no. I'm not going to go solo. I'm not going to go solo. Never mind. Um, their solo lane... I mean, ours is Grey main, so I expect theirs to be Arthas or Artanas. Honestly, the way I think they should do it, Arthas solo. This is their four-man. And they use Artanas to try and get a swap and kill. Something like that. But, like, we can kill Artanas too if they try that. Maybe it'll just be like Artanas AFK Park or top die. lane. The reason I think it's good if they put Arthas top, he's my best stacking target in the four man. So then instead you have like the Stitches Artanas style warrior that uh, stays far away and tries to get a swap and a kill. And then you prevent that Zul'jin trademark stacking that uh, is so easy to. Yeah, yeah. It's so easy. What if the enemy team is listening, Monka? I'm assuming that to be a fact these days, Tanku. That's fine. It'll just make it better practice for me. Let your failure begin. Yeah, Artan is here. Maybe they are listening. Or maybe they're just using common sense, you see? Do you want hats? Our ally requires help. The idea is I got uh, three stacks and uh, one damage on the Moonwa. Let your failure begin. Next time I'll have it. Hammer of the Lightbringer, I knew it. When you let a main assassin play Uther, they always... We must retreat. Take heed, mortals. I will arrive soon, and the demon lord is close by. I shall purge your evil from this land, demon. I'm not hot for you. Ah, I see what you did. done double poison versus solo uther oh yeah that's true smart smart guys smart drafters must i really remind you to choose a talent amani rage it is time for a change in strategy <laughs> cool. So I don't think that would engage was good. They tried to kill a full HP Malthea with, two, with the warrior and support instead of setting up for free on this thing. I should have been killing this instead of following. Um, but I didn't. So, yeah. Shame on me. Azimit. Azimit. 
I think we really struggling with Hero League ATM. Yeah, Plat. me too. Feels like I win one or lose one usually. Due to one or two players on mine or opponents doing whatever they feel like. If just one fight is lost, people start calling GG even if we are still ahead. Yep. Advice. <laughs> ignore them. Anyone that says GG, ignore them and carry on my wayward son. You cannot educate them, plus you should not want to educate them, because then they will get better. And why would you want them to get better? Because you're, you hate them, right? Because then uh, you can just uh, leave them behind. Our town is OP, by the way. Uh, you too, Rap Monkey, probably. Ah, I see what you think. Are you ready, heroes? We approach your position. Oh God. That will not do it all. I will do he even anticipated my dodge. Corruption, hell spawn. Again. Hot blade. Yeah, yeah, I did yeah, yeah. <laughs> When do you use Sojin's D? Whenever it's safe. Zorjan go where Zorjan go. See if I walked back. <laughs> I don't care. Another fort lost. Definitely not going guillotine here. I hate mush pit when boss is still up. It completely. I mean, maybe I should just use it as a zone, kill the boss. I've turned this on too late. 
bold strike, mortals. The demon will need time to recover. You call me? The dragon becomes me. And now kill with conviction. Double greetings, friend. Looks like a good game feels bad, man. Ugh, a clumsy display. Ooh, makes me wish I had the light kill. I'm hurting my city. You call that a triple kill? You call that a triple kill? <laughs> Let's go win now. Greetings, friend. Keep up the great work. Don't let HL get you down. No, Can no, it's charge. <laughs> I can charge. It's all good. I'm not getting down. Thank you, man. Choose a talent. I will get. Uh, you know, I could get ensnare for Artanis, but I'll just get lacerate. We shall return before long. You're the boss. Uh, Bruiser. I don't think it does that much against Core. I think it's fine. Mush already available. Nice job, everyone. Your core is under attack. We should probably just do the immortal. You don't get so much time that you can do a fort and then the immortal. Death timers are short. Be warned, allies. I move to greetings, friend. 31 months seems long obligatory monthly joke what did cinderella do when she got to the ball she gagged for the youngsters that's a joke about doing homework on time and responsibly i don't get it too whatever you want Yeah, we can wait for 16. Lost two. You're the boss. Do what parents. Arthas is flanking me, so I have to leave. Oh, Let's I just get it. sixteen. Care. 
enemy slain. Nobody farther than me. This world be fallen. Defend your call. I should need to tell you this. Another kill for Zorki. One of your keys is now a pile of rubble. We cannot rest in the face of victory, mortals. He will attack again shortly. Uh-oh. Time for me to go. Ah, I see what you're thinking. Titan Killer, Hunger of the Wolf, Remorseless Winter, Soul Collector. <laughs> I don't care. We still have a uh, level lead. That's interesting that we have level lead, despite losing four more forts and having fewer takedowns. More XP sub? They could be doing uh, impalers. They're attacking. We're still gonna lose. <sighs> maybe not, maybe not. We have to defend uh, early. Our ally requires help. Oh, I do. 
Doesn't work against blind. Are you allowing them to assail your core? Lol, freaking our tennis. Defend your core. Our foe is only wounded, not killed. This reprieve shall be brief. No! Help! Woo! Double kill. Well done. You survive. Will one okay. More? No, 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 no. I shall land in a moment, as will my foe. Bring down their keys. Finish them already. Excellent work. We must retreat. Q Q Q me. Q me Q me. No? Again! Uh, I don't care. I'm not Repent one. before my wrath, demon. <laughs> ah, I see what you think. Protect the core. The concept is alarmingly simple. We can still let it get to 50%. I must take up a new position. Death, 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 death. Go, 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 go. Okay, attack. We, have, we see two in their core. Cool. Uh -oh. 
From one HP to full. Thanks to Tastingo upgrade. The wickedness of hell dwindles before me. We need healing. Easy. We ought to take this mercenary care. I gonna bury you. Kill one of them for me. <laughs> Greetings, friend. Ah, Great to see you all back, Grubby. Thank you. Great job at BlizzCon. Thank Your you. Your draft analysis was so on point. Less than three. Thank you very much, man. Shouldn't we clear Bruiser first? Deal with the issue at hand. Greetings, friend. Oops. And there's still bots. We can actually do some keep pressure. Greetings, friend. Prepare yourselves. I will reach your position shortly. Okay, at least they didn't do impalers yet. We're also two levels ahead, that's kinda useful. Can't we do impalers? Such a defensive position of the immortal, what a troll. Let me see Malthiel be pushing. Is he coming back? Yes. <laughs> nice! Lunara! We need to put it on 50% ASAP. Oh my god, they're losing this fight. Leave. Oops. Oh, 
Enough. I seek better ground. They killed Tartanus and they didn't die. Nice. That was scary. That mouth chase. Backdoor risk. Yeah, I knew it. Our I knew it. Order to this realm. Still want to all in? <laughs> under attack. We need to take this GG! <laughs> Rixar, get Rixar! <laughs> okay, Artanis is at home. What a game. Jeebus. What a game. Oh, so stressful. I was so heavy in early game. So many deaths and swaps. But then Zul'jin late game is crazy. Greetings, friend. Oh. Hi, YouTube. Hi. MVP. Well, greetings, friend. Worth <laughs> it. <laughs> oh man, how much auto tech bonus is that? I don't know. I didn't see it anymore. Oh, 398 stacks of auto attack and 131 of the W. Crazy. Forty-two twenty-nine, Hero League Europe. By the way, master level. So I think I died like five times when my team nearly didn't die at all, like in the early getting swapped. I really need to have a strong look at myself why I got swapped so many times. I guess it's quest greed. Arcanite access quest greed and the trait you want axe. Just oh, trying really hard you. to stack it early. I got axe for, I got axe for you. Hey, Hamfist, thank you very much. But then, as you get to the late game, you get the Amani Resilience, the Tas Dingo, Divine Shield, Redemption. It gets pretty crazy. You know, a lot more consistent was, for instance, Genji and Greymane. They're also the damage dealers. They don't die as much, especially early game. Just doing their thing, you know, plodding away. But jeez, that one fight where nearly everyone died, that was crazy. Rewatch that fight, please. Yeah, we can check. I still think we should. Sh I mean, <laughs> that was, Greetings, friend. that's crazy, though. I mean, mistakes on both sides, you know. Let me see if I can rewatch that fight again. I think this is it okay so Arthas flanked me Rhaegar storm shielded most people in the mosh pit let's see how's our alts mosh pit we still have divine shield tastingo dragon blade so 
Let's play it slow. Okay, a little bit rewind. Let me see, 11.25, 11.15, okay. So this is where I switch target and I think, okay, I'm isolated, Arthas comes for me, I can hit him all I want, but I should switch to Malthiel. So I start hitting him. But I do very little damage because he's got that uh, level 13 block talent. Then Tasdingo. Lunara leaping strikes in on Uther ETC. Now everyone is getting really hurt from my W and auto attacks. I get 3,907 3, from Amani Resilience. Genji with the double kill there, very important. But he, <laughs> he happened to uh, E through a stun circle. Look also at the uh, prioritization of the Uther heals. Okay. Also pre-positioning, let's see. They get W'd. I'm walking in. I think that's fine. Artana swaps ETC, but he was still rooted. So Artana comes forward, but he doesn't get the displacement. Then blink, power slide, mosh pit. Okay. Greyman goes for Malthiel. He gets cleansed. Good job by Rhaegar. I start hitting Malthiel. I don't have vision on Artanis right now. Rhaegar lost vision. I turn on my thing and I start hitting things. Lunara comes in there, does a leaping strike that pretty much kills ETC. So she did a great job, but she probably shouldn't like be too eager to re-engage. Okay, Uther is about to heal Greymane right here. No, that was before. He healed Greymane instead of me because I'm on the effects of Amani resilience anyway, like coming up soon. Note who Uther heals. He can heal ETC or Greymane. Gives me D shield. After ta that's perfect. After uh, Amani resilience. Ah. Greymane cannot get out anymore. I miss my W, kind of. Yeah, super. I miss my W. I should have angled it like this. Let's see it again. Ah, D shield stopped the blind from Artanis too. Oh, that's huge actually. That should be a huge consideration because that's thousands of damage I could be doing. Yeah, I think Uther prioritized really well. He now uses Benediction. Yeah, Q's Greymane instead of me. That's the one I was talking about. That was perfect. Healing Greymane. Ah. Oh, yeah. Divine Shield at exactly the same time as Suppression Pulse. That secured us like another two kills. There's so much there that you... <laughs> There's so much in a fight that you don't appreciate when you watch it for the first time. Uh, like, if this W went like this... It'd be so much better. Wonder what I was thinking throwing it up there. I figured Rhaegar, like... I don't know. D shielding Genji would have been perfect. I don't know. I don't think that's true, actually. Maybe. It could be. You might be right, but it was two really valid targets. Did Cursed Bullet miss? Ah, I did. I guess it wasn't the best mosh pit. It's like two targets, but it zoned out Lunara a bit, I guess. But she gets a lot of damage on ATC. Tough fight for Greymane. Getting blinded, slowed, attack speed slowed, rooted, blinded. I 
I can't get enough of seeing Genji die into Lunara's stun circle. Uh, the, the Uther just messaged me on Twitch, Whisper, he said, I love you so much. Oh no, 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 that's not what he said. He said, I didn't consider that the ult was gonna heal you, that's why I de-shielded. But also it blocked the miss. Okay, so... He pretended that the, at the end of Tastingo, he wanted to have the protection. Rather than focusing only on the blind denial. But yeah, there was a lot going on there, whether he intended for it or not. Accidental pro moves are the best. <laughs> Do you ever feel like you lose your cursor in fights like that? Yeah, sometimes. Mm, but it's very rare for me. But let's say if it does happen, increase cursor size. Actually, it's something I did. This is default, right? This is big, thick cursor. Here's a tiny cursor. I have it center. That's bigger than usual. It's about average. I mean, it's an average size. It's quite, I guess it's quite clunky. They mean for you to use it like this, it's like default. If you lose it, you can just make it enormous. a lot of damage from me but we couldn't follow oh yes 